Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, I want to introduce a solution to be able to modify a 3D model in Blender. In the past, uh, we learned in this video how we can mesh editing in 3D Max. Uh, if you didn't watch this video, I propose to watch this video as well and learn how we can ed uh, modify a 3D model in 3D Max in just eight minutes. I will share the link of this video on myself and from my channel in the description of this current video. Okay, but in this video we want to learn how we can mesh editing in uh, Blender. But before that we should have a Blender. Uh, you should come over here blender.org slash download and you can download free the newest version of uh, Blender. I will share the link of this uh, website and the description of this video as well. After you download and install it, it's almost 300 megabyte. Uh, you will see you have here. Uh, it is a new empty scene. I propose to just remove light, cube, and camera. And now come back to our Unity. Okay, here, for example, we have this 3D model. Okay. This is F18C, but as you can see, the 3D model is not editable. Here, it is just an object. Look at this. You can't uh, remove these muscles or this bone or this field center. So, we should modify it. So, come back to our Blender, and here we have import. And uh, as far as you know, the format of this object is .obj, and it is uh, in my uh, assets folder. In the import, we will have obj wave front, and here I go to the my address. I will find works PC here and F eighty. Waiting for the loading done. Okay, excellent. Look at this. Uh, with my you know middle uh, button of the mouse, we can rotate with holding the shift and or using the middle of the mouse, we can move. You know, it's almost smooth. Okay. First, look at this. It has been you know ungrouped here. Now we can select any part we want. And for example, remove these missiles, this bomb, and these pylons as well. Excellent. And this fuel center as well. Okay, but look at this. I can't remove this guy because it's attached to the main field ledge. What do I have to do? Uh, I selected this field light object and here we have edit mode. Look at this. Here we can see the polygons of, and vertexes of this object. Okay? Just the fuse light, not other parts. Okay? And here we can see the you know edges and measures of this object. Here let's go to this pylon. And I'm selecting this guy. Uh, let me do something like this. I'm selecting this. Remember, the difference between 3D Max and Blender uh, by default is if you, for example, select this guy, if you rotate, you will see it is still left, this polygon. You know, you need to make sure you have selected your polygons object uh, you know, correctly from a different aspect. Now let's delete. Whenever you press delete button you will see this list vertex, edge, faces or other options. I said vertexes. Now it's gone. That's it. Excellent. Now I come back to the object mode and here I can select this guy as well. Okay, excellent. Now I want to modify my object. Uh, until now we learned how we can remove an object. Now we can learn how to modify. Let's come back to the, I don't know, 
uh, this guy, for example. And now I said edit mode. And this here, by default, it selected all of polygons. You need to select, uh, you know, somewhere else and come back to your, uh, you know, polygon list. Here you select this guy, just this. And now you can say move rotation in a rotation or a scale or transfer all of them at the same time for example I said move and now I'm making something like this <laughs> okay it is a new version of F18 really sorry Boeing company I'm making my own F18 okay this is my own F18 with a different shape of elevator. Okay, now I want to come back to the object mode and ready for export. I go to the export. I can select any format here, for example, but I propose to use Clada DAE uh, with, because it's uh, you know ungrouped all the objects of here and we can select anything we want in Unity as well. F18C, okay, and now export on the desktop. Look at this, exported 151 objects. Okay, let's come back to the Unity, and here I select image, import new asset, and come on, it's importing. Ta da! We have new version of F18. Look at this. Without missiles, bombs, and pylons, and also with a new version of elevator. <laughs> and also they are degrouped, ungrouped. Sorry. Look at this. You can select anything you want if you want to modify in in the in our future. Okay, I hope this short tutorial will be helpful for you. Don't hesitate to ask any question related to Unity, AR, VR and XR. Subscribe to my channel and like this video if you like it. Have a great time. Bye bye.